first Lego League is hard, but if you use your imagination, it gets a little easier. I wanna talk about the whale, feeding the whale the krill. Now the krill are in the whale, and if you flip that over, all the krill come out and you can collect them up and you can do all kinds of stuff. But getting the krill in the whale is very complicated. You have to do two actions, a poke, but not poke too hard, and a dump once the mouth is open. And it's hard because your robot can't get close to the mission model. These things are in the way keeping you from poking that. And it's really hard because, because this year we've got this no equipment constraint for this mission. So getting the krill, at least partly in the whale's mouth, is difficult and you can't leave anything behind. So I thought about recommending something big that you put on top that was somehow a little stick that down here and it would come out and then just gravity, I don't know, feed, trip in. I don't, it was complicated. And I was really just gonna suggest to teams that I mentor, you know, forget that. That's very complex and don't even worry about picking up the krill then. But we already gathered the krill and we only had one step left just to put it in the whale's mouth. First, I thought about dumping. Like, if the whale's mouth is already open, how do I want to suggest that we dump it? If the whale's mouth opened and then hit a latch that pushed this down, it could dump krill in. But this thing just looks like it's gonna break and not be reliable. And I'm really not one for building jigs. I don't like how big they are. I thought about a jig in the corner here that would, the robot could come over here and drive, drive over here and activate something that was already here that the krill could be in and it could be just dumped in. And, and that just seemed complicated. And if you don't have to be complicated, you shouldn't be complicated. So I thought there's a really easy solution to this. I'm just not really thinking about it. So then I started to mess with this little cart idea that it pushes against the whale down here and tips the top like that as these fingers that actually give you a little bit of wiggle room. If you're off a little bit, it will kind of guide you in because that, that's not a big target. It'll kind of guide you in. And as it pushes, it tips and feeds the whale. So if the robot comes and pushes this and somehow gets the krill into the whale's mouth and goes away, uh-oh, we're still touching. But with a, a clever, I don't know, claw thing that can hold the cart to a robot, this thing can come and put the krill in, back up, leave the equipment behind, and it's not touching the whale. So it meets the criteria for the equipment constraint. So it looks like this. This cart isn't something overly complex and it meets all the criteria for the mission. It even, you know, is pretty effective at solving this mission. And all the krill can be easily put in and dumped with ease. And the cart can be left there and it's easy to pick up and it's tough and it's not overly complicated for beginning teams to use a solution like, like this. Now, um, you know, maybe you can modify it, you can make it better, but I'm just saying this is, this is just some inspiration to solve something that's, I think is very difficult for a robot to solve. <laughs>
hey if if you liked this this whole thing then this video then you know like and subscribe it helps send it to other people it helps it helps the channel more people get to see first lego league when you like and subscribe now listen uh read your robot uh, read your robot game rule book that's how you say it and i'll see you in the next video